Hi guys, today's review is on a mascara. It's from Neutrogena and it's called Healthy Lengths. This is a mascara I've been using a lot recently and I remember years ago um, having used this as well. It's got bristles that kind of poke straight out all the way around as opposed to being one that looks like the bristles are like in a line that sort of spirals around the brush. A lot of times with brushes like that, I feel like they tend to make my lashes stick together um, just because I feel like too many of my lashes cluster between that spiral. So I do tend to like brushes like this that are the traditional bristles, but they're kind of poking out everywhere. And I would say that this mascara is easily within my top five of drugstore mascaras. I really, really like it for several different reasons. Um, I mean, a few others that I know I love, my Emily Award winner, the Essence I Love Extreme Crazy Volume Mascara. Also really like a couple from Almay, the Get Up and Grow and the One Coat Triple Effect. I feel like all of those give um, a pretty dramatic look to your lashes. You know, I like the length, I like the thickness. For this mascara, I feel like length is its biggest plus. It does do some thickening, but the length is what I'm really impressed with, and I also love that it gives me length without the funky ends. Not only are you getting a creamy formula in a lot of mascaras these days, but also like, itty bitty like minuscule looking fibers that attach to your lash and extend it out. With some mascaras, you know, you build them up on your lashes and you can s practically see where those ends have attached. Why can you see them? Because they're not extending straight out, but like maybe as the wear goes on, they'll bend in different directions. And I call those funky ends. And I hate to see that on a mascara. I've seen it a lot on my own lashes with various mascaras that I've tried. So I love that this gives length, but it's kind of like believable length to your lashes. Now I have this in the shade Carbon Black. I have repurchased a backup and I'll read you some of the claims. Um, it says deeply nourishes and strengthens lashes from inside out with an exclusive vitamin E and olive oil formula. Claims to have no clumps, flaking, or smudging. I feel like I see that no flaking claim on like every mascara known to man and we all know that not every mascara can pull that off. This one I can honestly say has not flaked on me. I mean it adheres to my lashes lashes and I, even if I have napped, if I've, you know, it's late at night and I've fallen asleep on the couch or something, I'm getting ready to take my makeup off and looking at my face, even then I don't feel like I see smudges, flaking or any issues. To get into more about how this looks on the lashes, I'll talk about it as you watch this being applied. And this is on curled lashes. My lashes were curled with my e.l.f. eyelash curler first. Um, and then I'm going in with my first coat and I feel like I can see the length building up really quickly. Love that I'm not seeing globs of mascara getting on my lashes. Also, I'm not seeing my lashes start sticking together, which is a problem I experience a lot with mascara. Then I go in with my second coat. That's when I start to see a little bit more thickness building up. So first coat, great length. Second coat is going to add your thickness. And I really don't see the need to continue past that point. You know, I've got the length and the thickness, two coats, no problem. Um, even on the lower lashes, since this isn't a real clumpy mascara, I can put it on my lower lashes. And again, not have the flaking off issue, but also not look like they're too thick with product. And the formula on this, I call it like a creamy formula. It's not like incredible dry, but it's definitely not like a wet oil slick kind of formula either. So, and as time goes on, it dries just a little bit more. So I think if you like a dry formula mascara, I think you'll like it from the get-go, but you'll like it even more as time goes on, as the weeks go on that you're still using this. If length is the top priority for you, I think you're really going to like this mascara because it gives length, but it really looks like good length, not spidery, weird looking length. Another thing I really like about it is while it can wear throughout a day and not be flaking off, it also doesn't make my lashes feel super, super stiff and hard. Look at that. I just like sweat my finger back and forth over these lashes and I still haven't messed up the looks of the ends. So if you're looking for a great drugstore mascara for length, um, I think this is worth trying. Thank you guys so much for taking time to watch and I'll see you soon. Bye.